Lord, where'd you go? Come quick. Lord. The snake is loose. We have to catch him before he eats Chester. It showed up in my Outlook calendar in March 2020. We thought it was gonna be a normal Zoom call. We were terribly wrong. Happy Monday, everyone. Welcome to, I guess this is kind of a TV show. Mm hmm. It is a TV show. Vic, we've gotta up our game. Lights, sound effects. At first, the show was fine. If you really want to understand the yield curve, you first have to solve for X. It's time to review a few investments from this week. Number one. Nothing too exciting for Monday. And then it got bonkers. Totally bonkers. It's 8.30 on a Monday, so much to say. Get in the boardroom, fire up soon, crank the volume. So now you're watching me on BXTV. It's mandatory. BXTV. Now for a special report from Lynn Elson in Europe. Hi there, sir. What do you think of Blackstone's high conviction thematic investing? No, mais vous êtes pas bien ou quoi? Je suis là tranquille en train de lire mon journal. Pourquoi vous me dérangez? I think he loves it. Mais c'est pas comme ça. And he loves BXTV. Non, non, mais... Joe, looks really bad out there. That's right, Vic. Pretty wet here in New York. Pretty windy too. But of course you'd know that if you just looked out the window. Never go on BXTV in late October. Are you ready to talk about our logistics portfolio? We think there are compelling opportunities in this sector. A mighty fine bounty to be had. Ahoy! Can you please stop that? Never! Vic, drum roll! There are some contests you don't want to win. And the winner of this week's photo contest, John Corngold, Goat Yoga. And he makes us wear it all week. <laughs> hey, I heard that. You want to hire 46,000 people to watch a Zoom call? Look, John says it sweeps week. Wow, Ed, that play is really, really interesting. Mm -mm. Hi, boys and girls. Today we're going to learn about what it's like to be a Bill. I'm just a Bill. Sitting here on Capitol Hill. Nope. BXTV might not be a viral sensation. Yet. BXTV. Who is John Gray? I told John so many times, I don't use beakers anymore. Oh. Help. Is there anything we can do to stop this? Yes. Let's fire John. But who's going to get us these cool bobbleheads? Ooh, can I have that one? It's not for me. It's for a friend. What if we made him think BXTV is over because he won? Give him some sort of award? What, like an Emmy? That is how we ended the lip sync contest. You'd have to be insane to believe that BXTV could even be nominated for an Emmy. Lore, we've been nominated for an Emmy. Of course. Yeah, I think he'll fall for it. <laughs> Nice shirt. <laughs> Can you believe this? No. <clears throat> and the award for the best weekly internal Zoom call at an alternative asset management firm goes to BXTV. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Oh my God, yes. 
Thank you. Thank you so much. I have a very short speech that I want to give here. It starts with my childhood. John, John, I'm really happy for you. I'm going to let you finish, but there is something I have to say. When Pete and I founded Blackstone, we didn't predict BXTV, but we knew something special could happen. Here we are 36 years later. The results for our investors have been outstanding, but the quality of our people, that's what truly sets us apart. Thanks to all of you. Oh, well said, Steve. We've accomplished so much with BXTV, but is John going to end BXTV? I make one call to the FCC, and they're going to cancel this clown car. It's ringing. Thank you. It's time to move forward. He's canceling the show. If only they knew about next season. Let them enjoy this one moment. Is it a heron or a crane? I have no idea. I think the snake got loose. Whoa! BXTV!